The most well-known clown is the August, is the dumb one or the clumsy one. At the circus, the August is often accompanied by another clown called a whiteface. His reaction to the buffoonery of the August is usually consternation or irony. I prefer the former because with consternation, the audience is not only ahead of the August, it is also ahead of the white-faced clown. This classic circus formula is often found in comedies. See this excerpt from season two of The Worst Week of My Life, written by Mark Bussell and Justin Spresny. I mean, look at the size of this thing. <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> Bandits at 10 o'clock, Ginger. <laughs> Give it here, please. Tally ho, Biffo, watch your tail. Give it here. <laughs> Enemy approaching, Squidgy. Give it here. Angela, have you seen Howard? He went up to see Mel. Howard? Darling, there's a call for Howard downstairs. And next in the swimwear section is Miss Weybridge. 46, 24, 20... Hello, Dick. I'm just uh, road testing Mel's maternity bra, just to make sure that it's safe. Um, these clasps here can really dig in. Uh, yeah, well, uh, I think that meets the required standard. Yeah. You're wanted on the telephone. Thank you. Another example taken from an odd couple episode called A Different Drummer, written by Frank Buxton, Michael Leeson, Gary Marshall, and Jerry Belson, after a play by Neil Simon. I'll teach you, it's going to be easy. You oh, have I haven't had my breakfast. Please. Musicians are always better when they're hungry. Sit down. You know that song that sort of features the drummer? Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, okay, let's wail. You'll, you'll come in on the brakes, okay? And... That was the break? That's the break. <laughs> Maybe I'm throwing too much at you all at once. Do you know how high the moon? Yeah, somewhere in the moon. Oh, that's close enough. All right, here we go. And. Too loud. Try the brushes. Ready? And. <laughs> I think your problem is you're trying to show off, you see. Yeah. Use just one brush. One brush? Yeah, yeah. Here we go. And. It is no wonder I am taking an example from the odd couple, since mismatched couples often operate on an august white face basis. Note that in this particular TV show, the roles often switch. Half of the time, it is the other way around. Felix is the august and Oscar the white face. In short, the comedy works like a two-blade razor. First, the August does or says something comical. Then the white face reacts and makes us smile or laugh a second time. Good writers of comedy know they must have white face clowns in their stories. And they know that the right reaction for the white face can be anything but to laugh at the August. The latter reaction is reserved for the spectator. Hats off to the screenwriters. <laughs>